What's going on everyone? So in today's return with this new banner that just released for Legends. Now, before we go into it, I do think this is a bait banner. It might be good, I haven't really looked into it just yet. But this is a bait banner, obviously. Um, let's have a quick look at who's actually on this banner. So we have the Gammas here. Gammas are still very good. Well, not very good. Well, they are actually pretty good still in PvP. They do have really good animations as well, especially for the LF, which I do like. Oh, I didn't realise you actually show it. Okay, we'll, we'll quickly show the LF while quick, quick, like quick talk about it. So, obviously, they are trying to do whatever they can, Legends, to make you summon before uh, Legends Fest. Which is happening in, what, two... Three, uh, three weeks, I think. Three weeks from now. Two or three, actually. And, yeah, as you can see, they're doing everything they can to try and make you summon. Because these gamers are obviously very hot, like I said, with animations-wise. Kit-wise are still good. So, they are doing everything in their power to do, you know, make you summon. So, this banner is obviously... Uh, I don't know why they bring out superheroes. It's a bit, bit weird, unless... Unless they are hinting at movies is going to be part of this upcoming celebration. Who knows? But I don't really see that happening. But yeah, yet again, who knows? So yet again, gamers are good. Uh, Super Zenfall Goku. Oh my god. Okay, well he's still actually pretty good. Oh well, after Zenkai. So that's another good bait. Rose, he's dropped off a fair bit. I would say he might be good as a bench unit, but other than that, he's not very good at all. Kid Boo, huh? Okay, is this where the banner dies off? So Kid Boo's pretty mid. Gohan can be good, I guess. I mean, he's probably average, I'd say. He's definitely not top tier anymore. He used to be really good, but now he's dropped off a fair bit with, like, um, you know, the meta's changed a fair bit. So he's not very good anymore, I'd say. He can be okay, but... Uh, Blue Gajidia as well. I did talk about this in a separate video, but I do see him getting a Zankai very soon. Possibly for Legends Fest, which would be pretty hype. Yet again, who knows, but if they are putting him on this banner, maybe they are hinting it he's going to get one soon. Because, when did he first drop? Was it first Legends Fest? I think it was, actually. That's a, <laughs> that's a fair bit ago now. So yeah, I do think he might get... Well, he actually deserves the Zenkai the most, I think. But we'll see. At the moment, he's not the best, but I think after his Zenko, he could be very, very good again. Broly? Okay, man. <laughs> well, now they put Broly on the banner again. I think, yeah, it could be a very good possibility. They are getting their Zenkos. Um, surprising, I still need dupes for now, I think about it, but this Broly is mid. He used to be good, obviously, when Legends Fest, well, when he first dropped for Legends Fest as well. Now, he's dropped off a fair bit. He can probably still be good, but I don't think he's like a top tier unit anymore but after his zen card depending how they build him he could be very good again and we have magneto okay well i don't really use him a whole lot but he does have cell max which is pretty cool so not a bad unit to get as well so the banner is a bit of a mixture i'm not really too sure how to feel about it to be honest yet again i'd probably at this point i'd recommend skipping Mainly because Legends Fest is so close, and we have no clue who it could be. Uh, I've seen people like speculate it could be like, you know, the Blue Boys, or like Kai Ken Goku and Believe Over Vegeta. That'd be very hype for Legends Fest. But there's a lot of possibilities. Oh, there's two times Z Pro as well, which is a pretty good bait as well. I will admit, but I still recommend not to summon. Obviously, if you guys want, that's so that to use. I'm just giving my point of view. I think it's best to save up. I mean, all these banners, even like, for example, Gogeta's banner here. Oh, I didn't mean to click that. His banner is terrible as well. well not terrible, but... Actually, no, I will call it terrible. It's pretty bad. We'll have a quick look, just to show why you shouldn't summon. So, that obviously, everyone's heard. Pike and Gogeta are pretty mid. Tag Super Saiyan 4s are good still, I'd say. On GT team, obviously. Gogeta, mid. This Gogeta will be good once he gets his Zenkai, like I said. Vegeta Blue, yeah, he's mid. Uh, Super Saiyan Goku, he's, yeah, he's mid again, actually. Super Vegeta, mid. Middle Cooler, I have actually seen people cook a lot with him. So, I don't think he's mid, but yet again, he's an extreme unit, so it's not really too hype. I mean, then you look at the other banners as well. There is tickets as well for this banner, but yet again, I wouldn't reckon summoning. Uh, yeah, just to, there's no other good banners out. 
So yeah, like like I said, I do recommend skipping. It's not it's not worth your CC, I don't think. Unless you're like a major fan of the gammas, for example, then I'd say summon if you want. Because if you if you look at it like the gammas are your favourite unit, this isn't a bad bun like bad banner to summon on. Mainly because there's less featured units as what um what eight featured units? Yeah, eight featured units. So when you look at this point of view, it is pretty good to summon on this banner, but yet again, like I said, with Legends Fest so close, I probably would recommend summoning just yet. At least maybe wait a week and see if we get any more hints towards what we can see, for Legends Fest at least, and then if you guys want to summon, I guess go ahead. But it's probably not the best idea, because let's say they, like, they drop something really, really hype, for example, for Legends Fest, and then you're thinking, damn, if I didn't summon, you know, use my 10k CC or whatever you got saved up, for this banner, then, you know, you could have had a chance to pull in a unit, but, you know, th that's how I sort of look at it, to work out. I mean, the gamers are probably still be good when Legends Fest starts, but it's just, you know, you have more of a chance of your CC, and probably better, but the banners will probably be pretty good then as well for Legends Fest. But yet again, we'll have to wait and see. But yeah, that'll probably be it for today's video, video guys. I just want to do a quick heads up about this banner, which is someone will skip. But, yeah, if you guys are actually going to summon or skip, please let me know in the comment section below. And, uh, yeah, if you guys want to see more, please do like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one.